hi guys welcome back to another tutorial video in this video i'm going to show you how to create a 3d text like this in affinity photo and as you know we don't have photoshop 3d plugin in affinity photo but of course we can import third party plugin but we won't do it in this video so we're going to create the 3d text manually okay so without any further ado let's get started first create a new canvas any size will do and then I will create a simple background. I will apply gradient overlay. Okay. After that, create a text. Just type anything and align it. Then duplicate this text layer by pressing Ctrl J and select the first text layer. Then apply outline layer effects and set the radius to 5 pixels. Okay, you can change the color. Okay, after that duplicate this layer and because I want the 3D text to face the left direction so move it to the left and upside two times. Okay, after that do it again, duplicate it and make around 25 to 50 of this duplicate layer. Okay, then click on the top text layer. And then align it like this as you can see we're almost done and like i said before the direction is optional you don't have to follow me to the left and upside you can go to the right and downside as well or to the up or downside okay so it's optional which direction you want to go okay after that apply layer effects to the top layer okay i will apply outline and again set the radius to five pixel and change the color or choose something brighter then I will change the text color as well I will change it into white color and apply other shadow so I will zoom in and set the radius to 25 offset 20 or 15 Okay, then I will also apply inner shadow, set the radius to 10 and the offset to 5 or 10 to create this effect. Okay, after that, we're almost done as you can see. Go to the bottom layer, select it, and then apply other shadow. Okay, for this one, set the radius to 20, the offset to 20 and the intensity to around 10 or 15 okay and it's done so that was how to create a 3d text okay oh yeah and you can also add the texture to the background so i will add this falling snow by paper forms i set Okay, and then I will change the blend mode to overlay and I reduce the opacity to around 50. Okay. Okay, so this is the final result. And so that was how to create a 3D text. Okay, and this is just a basic 3D text that I just show you. There are a lot of 3D text variations that you can try as well. So you don't have to exactly follow all of the steps that I just show you. Okay, you can add more settings okay, to create a 3D text that you like. Okay, so that's it for this video. I hope you enjoy and learn something new from this video. Hit the like button if you like this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in the next video.